Hi guys, and this is now part two of this episode, so basically we were in the Bison Steve Hotel looking for the Deputy Beagle, the guy that's going to give us information on the guys that shot me in the head, and we haven't found him yet, we're just looking around for him, as well as also raiding the place. He had, ah, never noticed that before actually, that's something new I've never seen. Right, we're back downstairs. Crafty little character my character is, so we're just looking around a little. Um Just looking at the amount of people we've killed already and we're only back. Oh god, I've glitched it. I've glitched it. Uh oh. There we go, right, okay, right. Oh, I was panicking a bit there. Uh, we'll head back downstairs and see what we can find down there. Heading back downstairs just to go and see if we can find the deputy, because I think he's downstairs, so we'll go and look for him downstairs. Alright, here we are. Back downstairs. And we're just looking around. Just to see if he's around, we'll just check. Everywhere. Um, I can't even get any maintenance door. It's ridiculous. This room we've already been in. So I'm guessing we just go into this little room here. Pretty much. And this is definitely going to be a fight in here. Alright. Still hit him, he hit his leg. Come on. Mm. Oh, ah. God. He's running. And quickly check the guy with the sword's body. Where is he? Is that him? Yeah, that's him. And he had leather armor. Do we want his incinerator? No. I'm already carrying too much. Wow. Close to leveling up though, so Some more scrap metal, which is what I needed. Now I've got too much. That's a bit better. We're going to slowly get enough bullets for that. Um, we've got the Gra plasma pistol already, so... The violent rifle, as usual, being the most common weapon of the game. Let's see what we look like now. Ah, uh, we look pretty cool. Right. They're fleeing. This gun is just crazy. Um, where'd the other guy go? Well, that was a pathetic battle. They completely lost it. They didn't even try to defend their own guy. And they didn't try to defend the guy they're keeping hostage either. 
I killed most of them. Oh my god. You can pay for that, and you shouldn't have been sat there. I'm sorry. Stupid idiot. <laughs> um. Um, right, okay, right. Let's raid the area before we attack and we get talk to him, because otherwise we're gonna. I'll take the knife. It's probably better to use melee in this game, to be honest. Uh, hardcore kind of makes it a bit more complex. Well, obviously. Why, yes, I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I've been... Indeed, I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. so gracious of you to offer to bodyguard me like that, but I'd only slow you down. See you outside. If you're not out there, I will shoot you. Right, I think we're done in here. I'm going to follow him out, I don't want him running away. Yeah, let's sneak with him, because that looks cool. <laughs> uh, right. Come over here and we'll follow him. Where'd he go? Should be someone brave like you, but more of a homebody. Someone who'll settle down and watch over. I heard the powder gangers talking about someone in the prison named Myers who has some experience as a sheriff. Also, with the NCR so close by, you may be able to get them to take over the town. Not sure. You would? You would? Yeah, yeah. Uh... Any luck finding a suitable kid? Ah, yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my bondage. I was skull. He likes what? <laughs> gathering information on something. Yeah, okay. Right. I'm guessing we got to go to Novak then. There's no light from here. And there's Nipton. And there's Novak. So we've got quite a journey. Let's head out. It's going to be quite a journey. Things really irritate me. Right. Now that was a pretty cool kill. Right. Well, so we're going to Novak to find some more information about people around. This Let's Play series should get to part 10 by the end of today. I'm going to try and get it up and. Oh, no, I'm going to pay. 
sorry. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Stop hitting me. Oh my god. There we go. Definitely a good kill. I'll take his revolver. They weren't exactly hard to kill, were they? And that's what I actually needed. Um, let's see what we can do. Melee weapons up to 20. Sneak up to 20. Lockpick up to 20. And... We'll get guns to 35. And we'll get... Speech to 17. You're gonna pay for what you did to the NCR. <laughs> Right, uh, let's check the bodies of the guys that kill, tried to kill me. Um, you pick up a lot of those while carrying around here. I'm not going to use the single shot, then it's terrible. Uh, let's have a quick look. Have a quick drink of water. I have loads and loads and loads of ammo. Definitely right. Let's go. We'll head over here and go up there for this episode. We're probably going to make it to that station over there by the end. We're going to head over there and then we're going to finish this episode and then I'm going to upload these onto YouTube and then continue. Later. I mean I've got to go to get my hair cut today because I'm going back to school tomorrow. So my episodes will probably be less. Yeah, right. They weren't too hard to fight, and we're heading up there in a minute, so. You suck. Die. Um, this convict was pretty rubbish as well. There's Stimpak. Pretty much it, so we'll head in here and we'll probably sleep for the night. Nevada Highway Patrol Station. Oh! Oh god, that's not good, that's not good. Ah! Ah! ah. episode here guys thanks for watching and goodbye